So you've got an awesome freebie that you're ready to share with your website visitors, but you're like, how the heck do I automate it? How do I get their email addresses in exchange for this freebie that I spent so much time putting together? <laughs> well, you're in the right place. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to put your freebie and or lead magnet, depending on who you're talking to, tomato, tomato, on your website and get their email addresses added automatically into your Flowdesk workflow and segments and all that good stuff. So stay tuned, grab your beverage. I have Earl Grey that I'm sipping on today. And yeah, it's gonna take a little bit longer than how I'm demonstrating today, but be patient, trust the process. We're gonna make it. Okay, so in Flowdesk, the first thing you're going to want to do is go over to Audience, and then you're going to want to click Segments, and then make sure you have your segment that you want your freebie to go to. Um, I call it Awesome Freebie, so you can just click New Segment, and then, you know, New, New, Awesome freebie had some issues recording with zoom so that's why i'm doing it this way and we'll save that or whatever okay then the next thing you want to do is go over to workflows and we're going to say you can see i just added it so i'll just go ahead and delete that but we'll go ahead and say new workflow and I did this one welcome sequence in a video I just recorded that had no screen sharing through Zoom. So lead magnet delivery is here. This is the one we want since we're sending them a freebie. And then our trigger is going to be when they are added to a segment and it's gonna be awesome freebie. And then we are going to say a gift for you as the subject line. A or your freebie, your checklist inside. And we can even put a cute little emoji if you wanted to. And then you can actually edit this. We can say new layouts or keep the old one, whatever. Um, I don't know why it's taking a while. Okay, we can ask it to hurry up. Let's see. I noticed it when I opened my Zoom um, cloud recording, it was like gone. I was like, are you serious right now? Well, while that's figuring out life's plan, this is what it current what a freebie sign up form currently looks like on my website. So I have a separate page for it. So if on your website, you're probably gonna wanna make a completely different page for it. And then I use inline forms in Flowdesk and then just make them look like a full page form. And I'll show you how to do that in a second. I don't know why this is taking a while. It's weird. Okay. This again, edit. I'll just say keep because it was, it was getting too hard. Okay, so because everyone loves a freebie, you can change the fonts here. And you can even upload your own fonts too, which I did all before. And then you can um, put a little picture here of the freebie if you want. And then, you know, click to download. And then you can change the color of this if you want of the button and then the font. So the font is um, font color. You wanna be able to see it. You can also just put a picture of your freebie if you want. You don't have to go with this whatsoever. So IG, I had it up here earlier. There we go. And then um, just roll with it like that. And then they get your, you just wanna make sure you have, so right here they already have the freebie button. And so here you click the button and then link, and then you attach the file. So you attach the PDF. You might have to resize the PDF if it's too large, um, but you shouldn't have that issue. And then right here, make it, make sure it says your name 
and you can even change the font of that and make sure the spacing is zero make it like um whatever your cute script font is for your brand you can keep your instagram there if you want and then you can take this off and you can just add a generic um button and say you know download my check get the checklist download Load the check. You want to make sure you have it as a PDF because a PNG, if, especially if you use Canva, a PNG with multiple pages is going to show up as a um as a what you call it um it's going to show up as a zip, which we don't need. So. Click to download, link again. You're just gonna make sure, so you can, yeah, attach the file and we'll say .pdf. I'm just picking anything. <laughs> anything at this point. Here, sure, that'll be cool. And then boom, and again, you just wanna make sure this button is very bright and stands out on the screen. And then the font is readable. Font color is black. And then boom, you're done with that. And that is the only email in the sequence. If you want to have a follow up, kind of like I did in my other one, you can add more emails to it, like a whole welcome sequence. Um, so that's the cool thing about workflows. The next thing you're going to want to do is have a form. So I went ahead and made an inline form that I kept it really simple. Get my checklist. Um, sign up here. You want their. You want to add the field, their first name, their email address. Get on the list. We probably want to make that a bright color as well. The font color will change to black, so it's all consistent. There's the picture of your freebie. How you do that? You just click here. You can change the shapes. You upload the file just like before. You might have to resize the file. Here we change the font, and there actually was. There actually was um, preferences that we could have had on here as well, but I just didn't want them, so I took them off. Um, so here you can see you can have different preferences if you want, but I just kept mine simple. And then when you're done, you're gonna click next and then continue, continue, continue. And then you're gonna have that code you're going to need to add to that page on your site. So. So what I did here was I added a page by itself, added the code, and then boom, it has first name, email, the little description, the title, and the picture of the freebie. So it is just that simple. Hope you enjoyed this. Woohoo, we did it! Cheers! <laughs> Let me know in the comments below if that was easy to follow, if I made it complicated AF. I do apologize if I made it complicated AF.